Hi everyone. Today I want to share some ideas with you how we could earn star coins in the game. These are very simple things that won't allow us to get unlimited amounts of star coins. But it could still help us to buy one or another leg rip, bow or other items that can only be purchased with star coins. If you are interested, stick with me. I think racing is a really good way to earn star coins. As Star Stable said, they want to update the racing system. It's really old. Racers get much less money than they deserve. 1,500 Jorvik shillings for a race in a month. And sometimes it takes hours to reach that time. It would be so great if there would be a way to choose between Jorvik shillings and star coins. For example, I think it would be fair to get at least 3,000 Jorvik shillings for a race monthly, which could be 30 star coins. You could choose which one you want. Or another idea, small challenges, like win 3 championships in a row to get an amount between 30 and 50 star coins. But there are so many other ways to earn more money with racing. Complete championships under a certain time, yearly best score in races, finish all championships on one day and similar things. In my opinion racing became a very underrated activity in the game. It's super fun, but really hard. If we could earn some star coins with it, the racing community could grow bigger. And now to give you a little motivation to the new race, here are some shortcuts that'll might help. It's a typical daily activity, you either love it or hate it, but one is sure, getting some star coins for races would give everyone more motivation. This shouldn't be more than one or two star coins for one race. We have to accept that star stable needs incomes too, and getting 10 or even more star coins for a race could allow us to earn around 500 star coins a day. Let's just be honest, this doesn't sound realistic. If we can get something by just playing the game instead of spending real money, we should really work for it. We don't have to get star coins for every single race. It could be something like complete all races to get around 40 to 50 star coins. I could also imagine to get some if our horse reaches a higher level. The higher the level, the more star coins. For example, 2 star coins if your horse reaches level 2, and 15 for level 15. After reaching the highest reputation level, the daily quests don't have a meaning anymore. We can still do them, but they only give us a few Jorvik shillings, so it isn't worth it. Why can't we just have a similar system with dailies like with the races, just as I mentioned? Actually, I think most of them are pretty fun. They remind me of the old good times. Of course there are some I can't stand, for example the Mystics, Nick Stoneground and the Dew family. It just takes so much time to get admired at these places, and there's nothing that pushes me to finish them. What about getting something more than only a congratulation if we reach certain reputation levels? Oh, I'm actually not sure if we still get this message, well, it's kind of said that all the work is so underrated.
And this is the reason why I still didn't finish my reputation at the GED. Like, what's the point of it? I don't feel like I would need any of these clothes. Star Stable added the achievements back in 2018, and I already felt from the beginning that nobody really cares about them. This is sad, because there are really fun tasks to complete if you are bored. Who knows, maybe a little reward would give even more motivation to complete them. Nowadays it takes around 2 years to level up after you finished all your quests. Let's just say it's a big thing that brings so much joy. So, why can't we celebrate it with a little shopping spree? 2 years of waiting should give us at least 100 star coins. It's not a lot, but it could still be useful. I've already shared this idea in one of my previous videos. In my opinion it's still the most realistic way to earn star coins by exchanging your book shillings. A lot of your book shillings for not too much star coins. Sounds like a good deal for star stable. If you want to know more about it, check out the video I linked in the top right corner. This is also an idea I've already shared in the past. It's really simple, get back 10% from the original price if the horse is level 1. Higher leveled horses could give more star coins. I know, there are a lot of problems with these ideas. There always were, are and will be cheaters who would destroy the natural way of collecting star coins. What Star Stable could do to avoid them? Firstly, to fix the cheat program. I just can't believe how they didn't manage to get rid of it, people are still using it. My friend Alexis managed to record someone who used cheats. I think it's terrible how they take away others' chances. It's been over a year since this cheating program started to spread. How is it still working? Why is it fun for people who use it on races and championships? So, fixing it is clearly needed, no matter if we can earn star coins or not, it's just unfair. The second point is, that there could be a limit. 
For example, the maximum amount of star coins you can get a day is 100. I know, it's not likely that Star Stable will add any of these, but we can still hope for something like this. It doesn't have to be exactly something from my ideas. I think getting 150 instead of 100 star coins a week could make a big difference too. What do you think about these ideas? Do you have better ones? I would love to know. Well, that's all I planned for today. Thank you so much for watching. See you in my next video. Bye.